At the end of this video, I ended up having to uh, run to Chickamauga. And then I went by where my daughter keeps her horses. And uh, one of them was sick. And uh, I put a few, few little shots of video in there at the end of this. So, so you can see the horses too. All right. Uh, horses doctor has been sick for a while. Hey. He's getting on up in age, and I think she said they sold it to her as a 12-year-old, but that horse is more like 20. Uh, <laughs> uh, but anyway, uh, hope you enjoy it. Talk to you later. Good morning, good morning, good morning. YouTube, Facebook, family and friends. It's me again. And I'm down here in the garden with Scott. And we're going to work on these tomato plants. And on high weeds, I showed you how they took over all this rain. Well, we got the DR mower and the lawn mower. And, and Scott said he, we got the chainsaw. Big weeds. <laughs> and we're going we're gonna to do a transformation here. And uh, is this all tomato plants right here? This right here? This row and this row. These two rows? Yeah. So we're going way up this way and we're gonna work these two rows all the way down yonder. About 200 foot. Yeah. So we'll be back with you uh, part of the way through and then try again. Let me run down through here first to see if I get and, uh, We're gonna see if the lawnmower will go down between them. It won't be. It not won't. that one. It won't. Cut it all the way off. Cut it all the way off. Let it kick off. Give it a second. Let it kick out. No. Never done that hard before. All right, Mr. Lawnmower. Got a lot of stuff on the belts and stuff. You, I had this thing all cleaned up. Well, I was <laughs> using it right over there, and it started raining. I had to get in right quick, and I was going to use it the following day, and it rained again. I didn't want to clean it up, but I got finished. Yeah. Let me flip my chair out here. I brought my oh, chair. I carried that uh, sprayer over at Manny's and the book. Yeah. We well, fiddled with this and the other found out the same thing we did. Stuff wasn't going through this thing. Yeah. He called the fact. He called the. That's what I suggested. Yeah. And uh, they said, uh, yeah, something was about that bad. And I wonder why they didn't recall all of them. I don't know. Did you take it? Are you going to take it back? No. Um, are they going to send you a note? They said they going to send him something that will take care of it. Change that or something. But, hmm. Yeah. Well, Scott. Oh. <laughs> I went into our gutter. Are you son of a? Hmm. Mm. That's not there. No, that's that's oh, in the starter. That's, so, that's in the starter. Yeah, so, yeah, huh? but that, that's pretty darn loose. Well, I'll let it sit there and I'll weed it. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna. Oh, crud. What right now? Yeah. I've lost my pliers. Uh oh. Let me set this up for maybe you want to trip over. Uh, well, you have them in your pocket, I guess? I don't know. I might have well, laid, me... laid them down cutting that wire or something. Well, let me walk back this way. You stay here. I'll, I'll do the walking. Uh, I'll backtrack. Uh, well, it, it, they're going to be laying. I got I got them out of the camper, so they're going to be laying somewhere from the grill where did I cut that wire, the yeah. the flat top black stone, yeah. uh, back to the uh, maybe even the generator sitting there, because right. I set my drink and phone on it.
Yeah, going back to look for the pliers. Yep, this looks like it's going to be fun. Y'all want to come join us? Come on. We need weed pullers. <laughs> Yeah, we get organized, we'll get to work. It's an overcast, the sun tries to come out and then it goes back again. Uh, but it, it hasn't got to the hottest part of the day yet. It actually don't feel too bad here. You get between these bushes and this corn and all these plants and there's no air. It'll, it'll get pretty hot in there. So anyway, I'll be back because I'm going to try to load this weed eater without the pliers. Well. I did this row, yeah, and I did this row up to where he's at right now, and uh, he's taking over. better already. You can see the tomato plants again. All right. We'll let you know when we're finished because we still got this road in there. Ain't that funny? That's just plum funny. I sit down on a lot more cranks about up just like it's nothing in the world wrong with it. That's just plum funny. Yeah, it is. So, he can raise the blade all the way up, make a, make a trip down through here in a little bit. Oh, dang, get this out of his way, whatever it is. Paper. Hmm. Yeah, that's paper. He's already way down there now. Well, I got the lawnmower running and put him on it, and he took off. And now we got a problem. A lot more stuck. Stuck in the mud. Whew, I can pull it out. Pull it out. Whew. All right, I'm gonna put y'all back in the shade so you don't overheat. Don't want. I. I don't want y'all getting too hot out here like we are. And uh, he's gonna have to back all the way down there. What's happening here in a minute? I'm gonna put you in the shade. Well, yeah. we're stuck. I will get on it and video it. That way, it looked like I got stuck. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I just told him you got stuck. <laughs> Look at that. 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 Look at that.
see if I can follow you out. Let me pull up a little bit and I'll get back and push you. something to drink or something to take the lawnmower back, I think. But, whew, these three, these three long rows are finished. Yeah, I think he's, he's made it back to right there. I, I talk about this grade right here. Coming down is no problem. And it looks level on video, but uh, I'm wore out getting to the top of it. <laughs> I don't remember being this bad years ago. No, we, we were. It was. We are. <laughs> That's why it ain't. <laughs> <laughs> you think it's still the same grade it was 20 years ago? It might have got a tad bit with water and stuff rushing down, but not a whole lot. It's just us, it's just us huh? We need to get in there and mow around the trees again. Yeah. Uh, the thing. The thing. Except for right over on the other side, that tub. Uh -huh. And down there in that corner, you see where it's a lot higher than the rest. You're, you should be fine to mow any any grade you want to mow. Yeah. I've used to push mower on it. So. And I mow about a half inch shorter than y'all do with the riding lawnmower. Yeah. I hadn't been down the driveway yet to see how it looks. It looks decent. I don't want to look decent. I want it to look real good. Hey, it was just three days I mowed that and mowed it again. Yeah. All right, buddy. I'm gonna go wipe some sweat off me and maybe ride around the air conditioner a little bit. Well, that's it for me in the garden. I left the I left the weed whacker down there. Maybe maybe he's gonna go rest. He's neither one of us in the best of health, and uh. Uh, let me open this door so some of that heat get out. This truck. I gotta put some air in one of my tires. I got a tire leaking a little bit. About every two weeks, I gotta put a little air in it. Uh, it's just, that's all that's leaking. I hadn't bothered to go down to the tire shop. Because I don't drive it no more. If I was going somewhere on a trip or something, I'd had, uh, have, well, I'd be honest with you, I'd probably go down and get some new tires for them. If I was going on a trip. Don't know if I'd trust them or not. Well, look, uh, the day is still young. I gotta find my deal with my sweat tail.
carried it with me, but I forgot it. I forgot it. I didn't forget the pliers. I just left them laying. I got them. I then left them laying up there. So, one of those things. All right. Everybody, put a smile on your face. If I can do it, you can do it. Now look, share it with somebody. Y'all have a great day. And I'm, but I'll be back this evening. It's kind of early still. Okay. Welcome back. I, you can't tell a whole lot because that corn grows across the aisles to each other. That's done. There's a row down through there now. And of course, the one I showed you earlier. Well, that's it, folks. He just went ahead and cut, mowed over the potatoes. Won't be nothing left to do but dig them up. Whew. Uh, that pretty much finishes everything up down here. Take the DR mower back to the house and clean it up. I think I might have a little bit of water in the carburetor it's not quite running right so i'm gonna put some treatment in it and see if that does it if not i'll have to drain the bowl and go from there but uh clean the filter on it but uh the day is over with here for most people scott he's still he's still picking tomatoes you need some tomatoes you're watching this you live around here you go down to rock spring produce he's picking a variety of them almost ripe ripe green tomatoes fried green tomatoes pretty tomatoes so, there you go he's back in there picking tomatoes that's all that's in here is tomatoes except for down the side lines down there the strawberries running down the side so plenty of tomatoes still to go all right i'm gonna let you go <coughs> keep a smile on your face remember to share it with somebody uh we're gonna y'all have a great day remember to hit that like button that share button share my videos i'd appreciate it i really would and uh remember to join subscribe to the page don't cost nothing and i sure appreciate it all right everybody have a great great evening from here in rock spring georgia we'll talk to you later christina where's your arm <laughs> <laughs> way up in here I figure it's way up in there since this horse's eyes are rolling back in his head. <laughs> Brian, give me another tap, please. How old is this baby? Huh? How old is this baby now? Well, he was sold to me as a 12-year-old. But he's been aged differently by a veterinarian. Yeah. Older. Yeah. You seen the pee since he's been here? No. He has poop stuff. I need another towel. I need you to keep the towel coming. Because these are eat or beat things. Easy. Easy. Let's see. Oh. On that back leg. Yeah, that too, but I'm kill I'm starting with the obvious first. Okay. He had a small one. 
think that's gonna make him act like that. He wasn't like that last one. But he did have a lot of stuff that wasn't allowing him to drop out good, so that can affect him. Yeah, that's not no fun. Is it? Clean that bucket up. Whoa, whoa. Ooh, whoa. Yeah, that's a good boy. Might as well do them all while you're here. Hey, and all this good. Huh? Hey, and all this good. It this doesn't matter if they're all this good or not. They got to be done anyway. <laughs> I usually have to look at the rabbit down there. Yeah, hey, I've got a bunch of them. I got a bunch of rabbits at home. I don't even see them all. No, no. Give me uh, some clean water and a clean pair of gloves. <sighs> you want a clean arm? Have <laughs> anyway. Yeah, mm. that's called getting up close and personal, buddy. <laughs> I know, I know. Y'all hey, don't be running. I've been through things. some similar things, you know, except with the long <laughs> hose. He did have a small stone, though. There goes our arm again. Y'all don't run around him. He's usually good, but I don't want y'all acting crazy around him. Put that stick down. Easy. Easy, easy. Down. Give me a, the bucket and a clean towel. I need the clean towel too, and then hold that bucket. I ain't gotta bend down in it. Be darn. Sure you give me another glove, please, hon. Got all kinds of help here. <laughs> yeah, but you're the one with the missing arm. <laughs> Unfortunately, this is part of horse ownership. Some things you just gotta do. Whether you like it or not. Yeah. Easy. I would tell y'all on YouTube what she's doing, but they might they might ban my video. I'm doing but, a sheath cleaning. But her 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 whole arm is disappearing. <laughs> yeah. And watch the eyes on this horse. See him roll back in his head. Mm -hmm. Now this is what you call being spoiled. <laughs> yeah, hold the plate up for him. He's I'll eat, but I ain't bending over to do it. He's the baby. <coughs> yeah, the hands are playing. Trying to check his foot. Yeah, he's trying to take his weight off of that foot. Huh? He's trying to take his weight off of that foot. <laughs> Let's check it. See what we got. Hey! That's one of my grandbabies. And the other one, the other one's hiding over there behind the bushes. Yeah. Just hold his head for me. No, you don't really, because in case he jumps, you won't be able to make it.